Well, the Bay County Supervisor of Elections Office gearing up for a busy primary election day today. Yeah, the early voting ended on Saturday and now voters have until 7 o'clock today, starting at 7 a.m., to cast their ballot on several state and local races. News 13 says Roland live from the Supervisor of Elections Office in Bay County with all the info you need to know before you get out and vote. Hey, good morning, Chris and Kelsey. Yes, polls open up in two hours, and this is your last opportunity to cast that ballot and make your voice heard in this election. I'm joined live this morning with Mr. Mark Anderson. He is the Bay County Supervisor of Elections. So, Mark, I'd like to talk about a few things. So this is actually the first statewide election in which we do not have those super voting sites, which was granted, of course, after Hurricane Michael. So what does that mean for those who are going out to cast their ballot today? It means they need to know where they're going. Okay. <laughs> They've got to know the specific polling location they're assigned to because that is the only place they can go today. Yeah, so you have to go to that assigned precinct. So for those who maybe waited till the last minute, which I know it's some folks probably in our audience, how can they find out that information of where exactly they're supposed to go? Well, starting at 7, you can call 784-6100, 850-784-6100, or you can go on our website right now, put in your information, and you should be able to find your website there also. Yes, you can plug in, of course, your name and then your date of birth, and it'll pull that up as well. What do you need when you cast your ballot? I understand you have to take some things. You also have a sample ballot on your website. Right. We have sample ballots. You can take those, <clears throat> have them pre-marked. At this point, you need to be a little bit more prepared. If, you don't, if you're not sure, find out early this morning. Please don't wait until 6.50 tonight to figure out where to go and vote because it'll, it may be difficult for you if you... Uh, none of the places are normal, so everything has changed. Everyone got a sample ballot. If you've got it, pick that up and look at that right now. Yeah, you definitely want to be educated on the choices that you make. And let's talk about the turnout. How has it been so far? Well, the turnout's been the voters that have turned out. To, you know, that's basically where the percentages go. Um, the people that show up and participate will be the percentage of turnout for the election. All right, you definitely want to have your voice heard again. You have until 7 tonight, and the polls open up in two hours. We're going to have a lot more from Mr. Anderson a little bit later in our show. But for now, live in Panama City this morning, Tess Rowland, News 13, Panhandle Strong.